Like trypophobia, mesophonia is a condition that people have been studying only a little bit over time and hasn't had a lot of uh, research poured into it. But it's being annoyed to the point of perhaps rage by hearing some sort of irritating sound, um, such as loud breathing or eating food loudly, like the sound an irritating person makes when they're chomping on a banana and they don't realize how annoying they're being at all. You're the worst person alive. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. Um, so, Many people have this um, would be in reaction to perhaps people eating a banana or maybe some loud crunching food. John Iderola says, I eat chips too loudly. I disagree. Uh, maybe he has misophonia. Maybe I eat chips too loudly. The world will never know. Stop motioning at me off camera. Um, but it's also like loud breathing. Perhaps even snoring will fit into this. Uh, I personally... I think I have it toward loud breathing, mm. where it's, and then I feel bad because then the person's like, what, you don't want me to breathe? It's a tough, you want me to die? It's a tough line in no, the sand to demand. you know that's not what I want. <laughs> Just do a better job do, at it. Do it better, on, I know man. you can, you have a nose. We've been doing it for years. <laughs> um, and we've talked about this before, about it being an, uh, something that some people do suffer from, but there is being more research done on the case. There may be a neurological explanation to this according to Sukhbindar Kumar and his team in Newcastle University, uh, UK, which carried out a series of tests on 20 volunteers who suffered from extreme forms of misophonia, as well as 22 people who do not. So they were, uh, both groups were exposed to different sounds, normal sounds like rain falling, unpleasant sounds like babies crying, and typical misophonic sounds such as chewing or breathing noises. And what they noticed in the misophonic group was that they experienced increased heart rates and skin conductance, both signs of the body's fight or flight response when they hear those noises. Um, so if you've ever suddenly felt like you needed to leave or if you were enraged, That's you may have this condition. Yeah, yeah. Um, That's exactly mine would, what it is. That's crazy mine would to be me. The rage. You need to fight someone for breathing I or chewing. Want, it's very hard to, for many reasons, to share a bed with me because if I hear snoring or loud breathing, I'm going to go off the handle. I'm and so thankful my wife's not the same way. You should feel thankful, and you should be thankful <laughs> you don't feel that way me. either, because it is not fun to live with or have to explain all the time. Yeah, um, and even, like, doctors don't take it seriously. You tell them that you go into a rage when people eat around you, and they laugh at you. They don't want to treat you because they don't understand well, that sort of mental here's disorder. Here's the deal. There may, may actually be a neurological explanation yeah. because brain scans revealed that the uh, people with extreme misophonia had heightened activity in the anterior insular cortex, which is known to play a central role in determining what's what things we pay attention to. Or So like if I'm supposed to be listening to uh, Jenk give a speech, but someone near me is chomping loudly or breathing heavily, I'm going to be confused in the anterior insular cortex and not pay attention to the right thing. Perhaps um, I, I can speak, I can remember very specific times where I did feel this way and I did not listen to what I was supposed to listen to um, because of this extreme ir irritation. But so, right now there isn't a lot of research going on and next to no treatment, mostly people cope with this disorder by getting up, leaving, wearing earplugs, or timing your chews to other people chewing. I've never thought Be of that Because uh, apparently it doesn't bother, their own chewing doesn't bother them. Yeah. So they'll try to eliminate because other people's chewing with their own. Because you can predict that more, yeah, 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 yeah. I think. Um, that's just a conjecture. So according to this research, uh, people who suffer from misophonia um, had parts of their brain, regions of the brain called the ventromedial prefrontal cortex had a higher level of myelination, which is fatty sheaths uh, that are around the nerve cells and help conduct their signals, uh, which may explain a biological reason why you would have greater conductivity and therefore greater sensitivity to these, these innocuous noises. I, I struggled calling them innocuous. <laughs> um, so there may be actually be a real reason as to why this is happening. Yeah, I You're mean, not crazy. And you don't let anyone tell you to just get over <laughs> it. They should breathe better. 
yes, or stop eating that banana so close to my face and stop eating that bowl of cereal like a gorilla eating a log cabin. Um, it, it just at least explains that there may be a cause for this and that you're not just making it up and your doctor shouldn't be laughing at you. you're not overly sensitive or bitchy. There's something in your brain that's a little bit different and is lighting up in different ways as to why you are reacting um, in an angry or maybe awkward way if you're running away from yeah. what should be a normal uh, social <laughs> moment uh, this is ringing so many bells in my head uh, this could be perhaps treated with behavioral therapy or um, if with some sort of uh, treatment to those portions of the brain it's not nothing is really listed as so far yeah or better understanding by your friends family and co-workers who may not realize that this bothers you mm -hmm. um, so don't feel like you're you know you're just making it up it is an issue. There's going to be more research done into it. I find these things annoying too. It's okay. Let's chat. We'll all feel better about it together. Audience, do you think you have misophonia? Please let us know below in the comments and please like and subscribe for more.